Hi, in this video I'm going to demonstrate the differences between margins, padding, and border in cascading style sheets. So I've set up an HTML file uh, as such. Uh, it looks pretty ugly, but um, the con colors are pretty contrasting and you'll be able to see the differences between the three things. So um, right now I have the padding and margins set at zero pixels, so there, there's no padding and no margins, and uh, the border width is 10 pixels wide. Um, you can kind of see the border, it's red, it's dotted, uh, very, very visible. So what I'm going to do first is I'm going to change the padding right, to some kind of bigger size. So I'm just going to put 50. And when I refresh, um, the space in between the border and the content inside the uh, div uh, has increased. So uh, basically this is what padding is. Padding is the space that is in between the content and the border. And uh, basically, if you don't want your content to be sticking next to the, the border, uh, you would want to increase the padding. And uh, similarly, well, uh, let me show you what margin does. So I'm going to reset this. And I'm going to put the margin at 50 pixels. And when I reload, um, as you can see, the space outside of the div has increased. So this is what the margin is. It, margin is the space that is outside of the border. Right? That is, um, if you don't want uh, things sticking together, uh, tags to sticking together, you would want to increase the margin size. Now I'm just going to reset this um, to zero, and I'm going to show you the border width. All right, right now it's set at 10 pixels, and um, usually borders are really not that thick. Um, so I'm just going to decrease this in size, and as you can see, uh, the border around this div tag has uh, shrunk or gotten thinner and um, but the dotted lines kind of get um, stay the same it's still dotted and uh, it's still red so I'm going to combine the three things uh, together the three differences that I've shown you together save and refresh and this is what it looks like So there you have it, margins, paddings, and border. Uh, if you have any questions, please let me know.